everybody, welcome to my channel. I'm going to teach you today how to get white teeth at home, super duper cheap and so easy. I'm gonna be linking in the description box below the original OG beauty guru of YouTube where I learned this from and I'm just gonna kinda tell you how I maintain white teeth as a heavy, heavy coffee drinker. So to keep my teeth white at some points in my life was kinda difficult, but oh my gosh, that video changed my life. Let's get into the video right now. So we're gonna start off with mentioning the magical product that gets you white teeth, and that is the Plus White. Plus White five minute speed whitening gel, and you can pick this up at Walmart. I think it's around five to ten dollars. I don't know, it depends on where you are. And they also sell tubes of it on Amazon, but I will warn you guys that the tubes that you get from Amazon are like this big. You're probably wondering if it's cheap, why would it work? That's because Candy Johnson, who is the one that made the original video, she actually used to work in a dental office way before her YouTube days, and it turns out that it's the same exact whitening gel that they use in the dental office. I am going to demonstrate how I use this coming up. First, I'm going to show you everything that I use for teeth whitening and maintaining white teeth. In Candy Johnson's video, she mentions getting the sport guards and how you can make them mold to your teeth and I did that, but I also did her tip where you can kind of cut it to make it a little bit smaller to fit in your mouth. But what effect that had was a lot of cutting on the inside of my mouth and it hurt really, really bad. I have not gone back to Walmart to buy more, but I do plan on doing that. The reason why I haven't is because I found this guy at the dollar store and now Dollar Tree sells teeth whitening gel. It is not the same kind. I actually bought it just to have this little guard. It works great for right now. And actually having those sport guards that kind of have like the molding of your teeth inside doesn't make a difference. My teeth with this get white just the same as they did with that. The other item I recently started using again, because I have used this before in the past, I saw Brittany Vassour's video on how she maintains her white teeth and she swore by the Sensodyne Extra Whitening Tube of Toothpaste. So I went ahead and grabbed this because I thought it would be great to just use. I'm already gonna brush my teeth every single day, so it would be great to add on to whitening my teeth here and there. I don't do it all that often anymore, but to have this on a daily basis has definitely been making a difference. This is the floss that I use and it is the woven type floss. I find this the best, most comfortable way to floss my teeth. I've never liked flossing. I've always found it painful for whatever reason. I have sensitive gums and I love this. And plus it's thicker, so I feel like it does remove a lot more between the teeth. And this is just the Listerine brand and look for, doesn't say on here that it's woven, but I think the package that it came in said that it was woven, but that is how you will know, is make sure that it says somewhere on the box that it is the woven if you have issues with the wax floss. I can't stand it personally. You can whiten your teeth just after giving yourself a brush, but getting in between the teeth makes a huge difference because once that stuff is removed, the whitening gel can really get in between your teeth. And my bottom teeth are really tightly together, so I feel like there's always more yellowing that happens in between my teeth. And my goodness, flossing with this stuff definitely helps that whitening gel get in there and remove those stains. Now I'm going to get into the demonstration part. Please smash that like button real quick if you like the video so far, and let's get started. There are different ways you can apply this to your teeth. I have tried using a cotton swab, but the cotton on the swab does absorb some of it. So what I like to do is just straight up use my finger. I will show you guys the consistency of this. It is, whoa. It is very, very liquidy. It is like watery, so you should only put a little bit at a time. I put it on my finger, I go here, here, and it is very important to get behind the teeth. Your teeth are slightly transparent, so if you don't whiten the backs of your teeth, whatever staining is on that side will show through in the front of your teeth. So you wanna whiten the front and the back. I'm not gonna be able to talk during the whitening process, but I'm gonna put it on the front, the back, I'm gonna place this guy in my mouth, and then 
I'm going to set a timer. Now it does say on here it's a five minute speed whitening gel, but five minutes basically is when it starts working. So I recommend doing 10 minutes and definitely if it's your first time ever trying it and you maybe have sensitivity to certain products like that, I would definitely just do the five minutes the first time. But you are more than welcome to do 10, anywhere from 10 to 20 minutes. The first time I started using this, my teeth were pretty, pretty yellow. And I have lots of result photos that I will show at the end of this video. So stick around if you want to see my results. Those were from 2017 and I was doing it on a daily basis for like um three to four days to really get my teeth started in the whitening process or whatever you want to call it so bear with me this might be a little awkward i'm trying to hold this mirror So I just rinsed my mouth out, I'm all done. I did it for 10 minutes this time. And I wanted to let you all know because I'm pretty sure some of you out there have sensitivity to teeth whitening and probably a big, the biggest question out there is gonna be, does it make your teeth sensitive? I wanna warn you guys that for about the first day, it, my teeth are a little bit more sensitive to the cold, but overall, they have not become more sensitive. And that is another reason why I'm obsessed with this stuff. In the previous years, when I was a lot younger, I did crest whitening strips all the time. And what's crazy about those is, yeah, they work pretty good, they're really expensive, but oh my goodness, they made my teeth sensitive and I felt like they were sensitive for a very long period. So I really do like that with this stuff. For me, it doesn't make me extra sensitive or anything. So if that is a big issue for you guys, I just wanna put a disclaimer out there that I'm not sure if it's going to make you and your teeth sensitive more than mine, but for my personal experience, I do tend to have sensitivities to teeth whitening, and this one doesn't affect me, but maybe for the first day. What's really cool about that Sensodyne toothpaste is that it is for people with sensitive teeth. So maybe if your teeth are sensitive after the Plus White, using the extra whitening Sensodyne along with it, it's gonna help your teeth not be so sensitive. You know what I'm saying? I feel like I was so boring in this video, you guys. It's totally not like me. I am like totally out there, weird, eccentric, whatever you wanna call it. But I hope that this video was helpful for you guys. If you enjoyed it, let me know. And if you have any more ideas on some content that you would like, if there's anything you haven't seen done before, maybe you wanna know how I do something. I do have some photography tip videos coming up, so look forward to that. Make sure that you guys hit that bell and I know that this is repeated in everybody's videos but for real I've noticed that my favorite youtubers I never knew that they were posting videos because the bell wasn't selected you're not gonna get a lot of notifications on your phone but when you open the app you will see that little like dot notification thing and then you're gonna click on it and you're gonna be like oh she has a new video so that is what the bell thing is all about so if you guys hit that bell I will just love you even more I thank you guys for watching make sure you watch one of these videos right here because they're cool put a lot of time into my videos so yeah I'd appreciate that I'll see you all in my next video bye